Hi everyone, it's Elle. Right, welcome to my new vlog. So, where am I off to today? So today, I will be seeing Jesus Christ Superstar in Regent's Park Open Air Theatre and I'm so, so excited and today it's a gorgeous bank holiday Monday so it will mean London's probably going to be absolutely packed and manic but anyhow, but anyway that doesn't matter um, but matter and I'd be a bit, wouldn't be as fun if it was raining so I mean I managed to get tickets to see the show a couple of months ago though in the last, they were among the last few so and you are going to come with me to London yay let's go now in Regent's Park so we're just having a sit down and a bit of a break because oh, it's very very it's a very very warm and hot bank holiday and this place is absolutely heaving and but it's a really nice place to be back in Regent's Park I haven't been here since well the first time I went here was three months ago and it was with and it was for the first anniversary of my friend's theatre company Bears and Vagabonds and I got a special award for the company's most ardent supporter. <laughs> Thanks, Adam, for that. So I think we're just going to be wandering around the gardens for a while until quarter past six, where we've got a dinner reservation for a restaurant that's near the theatre. So mm, mm, we're just so happy to be back here in Regent's Park because it is just so beautiful, and I just sat down and really visited and visited so often. <laughs> Bit of a bit of nostalgia here because over there was where we had where we were stationed for the Bear and Vagabonds picnic in May, and it was just such a wonderful day. And it was the f my first solo trip to London on my own, and I just loved it, really, really did. And just seeing where it was has brought back so many wonderful memories. And <laughs> is just there and we can hear the music and because we'll, we'll be having um, dinner in there once the gates open and so we've basically just been wandering around we've had some orange ice cream and oh God, I'm just so so excited to be to be here and uh, um, so we've still got quite a long a long wait but thankfully I've got oh, I've got this to entertain me I might learn some more logs before um, whilst I'm waiting out here um, if you want to, because I've done some of the, some of these um, that are in here, so if you look along, look on my channel, you'll, you'll be able to find them. And the last one I did was Isabella's monologue from Shakespeare's Measure for Measure. So do feel free to check that out if you want to. And hmm. okay, so okay, so we're now inside well kind of the outer bit of the um Regent's Park Theatre and we've now got our table so we're gonna go have some some food before we go into the performance which starts in about uh hour and 25 minutes so I'm just so 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 excited to be here but <laughs> I'm just so so excited to be here and uh, looking through the program I actually I recognized David Thaxton because I saw him as Javert when I saw it for the second time in the West End quite best quite I can quite cool I can say I've seen Les Mis in three well three times and in two countries twice in London once in New York and 
think Kayleen McKnight, I, I think I saw her when I went to prison lane. I saw Les Mis at one point, I think. Might be, might be wrong. And another thing I'd like to reveal is um, Paul Nicholas, who was the original Jesus Christ superstar, played King Rat in the Cambridge pantomime of Dick Whittington, and I saw him, so that kind of was kind of one of the reasons why I'm just so excited. And my first experience of Jesus Christ Superstar, I think, was when I, I did Stagecoach, so this was quite a long time ago. I think it was when I first started, and we learned some of the chorus stuff and I just and I remember just thinking wow this music's just amazing but I've wanted to see this show for like five years years I think because um I you know I watched videos of the arena tour version starring Tim Minchin and Ben Forster and Melanie C and I was like and that just, that just made me go more wow and just really so I'm just so I just feel so fabulous and just I just feel so blessed to finally be given the opportunity to see such an iconic show and and I did a cover of I did a cover recently of I don't know how to love him and I'll put that in the description box if you'd like to check it out so it, I'm not sure how well you can see me because of the lighting position, but <laughs> sorry, just oh my god, it's just oh my good lord, in oh sorry, can't just everything the singing, the dancing, just the everyone really, everyone's just so amazing. Like, I haven't seen such particular spectacular voices in such a long time, and just all struck really and just seeing this it's really made me fall in love with the music all over all over again and I just love it I just <laughs> so we're now just having some pudding and like, jump back in in about 20 minutes <laughs> wanted to record the last bit now so that my mind had time to process everything and have a bit of a ugh from last night so what did I think oh, I honestly just absolutely loved it the singing there was just amazing and that is the best quality and that's the first load of singing in a long while that's when we go Wow, and I really liked how it was kind of a bit more. I took more of it of an epic theatre kind kind of style, and how it was all kind of most how it was really stripped back. So you focused on the acting and the songs and the messages that were coming out as a result, coming out through the songs and through the performance of the actors. Really, really nice use of the ensemble, which I talk about. I talked about earlier on in the vlog. And it was really nice to see how they took a bit more of an active role and they had role to make to make things a bit more deep or more resonant for the audience and it was really nice how on many moments it felt like that as an audience we were members of the disciples and we were the crowds that were watching Jesus's crucifixion so I think really that was really the one of the best performances one of the well one of the, more one of the best shows I've seen in a long time and I just feel so incredibly lucky to have seen it so to everyone in Jesus Christ Superstar thank you so so much for such an amazing night out you should all be so proud of the performance and the show you've created and I just feel so so inspired so if you if you like this video please um please hit hit that like button and hit subscribe if you'd like to check out other bits of my on my channel you can so in the, in the description box below i'll put in the links to some of my song covers and some of my shakespeare beer monologues if you'd like to check those out and i think probably my next load of videos will probably be when i've started university and well, how often i'll do those up i don't really know so I think that very much concludes the vlog. I hope you've enjoyed it and I'll see you next time.